Dear viewers, welcome to our channel. With the rapid development of technology, human pursuit of communication technology has shifted from 5G to the more distant era of 6G. Recently, at the MWC 2024 exhibition in Barcelona, a new alliance led by NVIDIA called the AIRAN Alliance was officially established, marking the official start of the competition among global technology giants in the field of 6G technology. However, it is worth noting that Chinese companies are absent from this alliance, undoubtedly bringing challenges and opportunities for China's development in the global communication industry. Faced with this situation, Chinese companies need to examine their own development strategies and actively respond to challenges in order to seize the initiative in the 6G era. Will the formation of this alliance lead to the monopoly of global communication technology, thus affecting the development space of other companies? In the absence of China's participation in the alliance, how can Chinese companies respond to this technological blockade and maintain their competitiveness in the global communication industry? As the 6G era approaches, how can Chinese companies balance independent innovation with international cooperation to achieve sustainable development and innovation? The birth of the AIRAN alliance marks a fierce competition for technological dominance. Comprising leading companies such as NVIDIA, Samsung, ARM, Ericsson, Microsoft, and Nokia in the semiconductor, communication, and software fields, this alliance is dedicated to promoting technological innovation and aims to establish their dominant position before the arrival of the 6G network revolution. The alliance essentially aims to create a closed technological ecosystem maintaining their dominance in the global communication market through collaborative research and technology sharing. According to the latest announcement from Samsung, the company has joined the AIRAN AI-powered radio access network organization as a founding member. This move signifies Samsung Electronics' commitment to driving the innovative development of the next-generation 6G network by integrating advanced AI technology with wireless communication. As a global leader in electronics and communication equipment manufacturing, every step Samsung takes in wireless communication is closely watched by the outside world. Through cooperation with global technology giants such as NVIDIA, Samsung is expected to further accelerate its innovation in communication technology, while promoting the development of wireless network technology. NVIDIA is renowned for its outstanding graphics processing units, GPUs and deep artificial intelligence computing capabilities, providing strong technical support for intelligent wireless access networks. For American tech giants, the establishment of such alliances significantly reflects their strategic considerations. By integrating their respective expertise and resources, these companies have jointly formed a powerful alliance, aiming to seize the upcoming wave of 6G technology and compete for a leading position. For China, the emergence of this alliance brings certain pressure and challenges. Despite the increasing presence and influence of Chinese companies in the global communication field, their absence in this strategically significant technological alliance undoubtedly sets a challenge for China to further compete in the international communication industry. AIRAN, AI-powered radio access network, refers to the application of artificial intelligence technology, AI, in radio access networks. RAN, to improve network performance, optimize resource allocation, enhance network management capabilities, and improve user experience. The core idea of AI RAN is to utilize ARI's machine learning and deep learning algorithms to analyze large amounts of network data, thereby achieving more intelligent network decisions and operations. The AI RAN Alliance aims to integrate artificial intelligence and wireless communication technology apply them to various fields, create ecosystems, and ultimately expand opportunities for new businesses. It conducts related technical research through three working groups, AI for RAN, AI and RAN, and AI on RAN. Currently, there are a total of 11 companies and organizations that have joined the alliance, including Samsung, Arm, Ericsson, Microsoft, Nokia, NVIDIA, SoftBank, and Northeastern University. Facing challenges often hides opportunities for development. In the challenge of technological blockade, Chinese companies need to deeply reflect on their development plans and technological fields. 
Firstly, strengthening independent innovation is crucial. Chinese companies need to rely on self-research and technological innovation to break through external technological barriers and market control. Secondly, actively seeking and strengthening cooperation with international partners can enhance their technological level and competitiveness in the global market through technology sharing and joint research and development. Ultimately, these companies must closely monitor global trends in the communication industry and market demands, adjusting their business strategies and directions in a timely manner to adapt to the evolving international market. In this transformation process, China's role is crucial. The government can adopt more open and flexible policies for technological innovation, incentivizing, and supporting domestic companies to engage in the exploration and application of 6G technology to promote innovation vitality. In addition, strengthening cooperation and exchanges in the international technology field can not only promote Chinese companies' integration into the global communication industry but also bring new development opportunities to China's technology ecosystem. Furthermore, China can enhance the integration and optimization of the domestic industrial chain improve the overall competitiveness and innovation capability of the industrial chain. In the era of 6G, the development of communication technology requires not only breakthroughs in single technologies but also deep integration and collaborative innovation of the entire industry chain. Therefore, China can promote the upgrade and development of the entire industry chain by strengthening cooperation and collaboration among upstream and downstream enterprises in the industrial chain. Moreover, China needs to pay attention to the development trends and market demands of the global communication industry, actively participate in global competition and cooperation in the communication industry. In the context of globalization, no country can stand independently outside the global industrial system. Therefore, China needs to actively participate in global competition and cooperation in the communication industry, enhance its competitiveness and innovation capability by learning from international advanced experience and technology. Finally, let me summarize for the readers, hoping you have gained something, inspiration and reflection. The establishment of the AIRAN alliance signifies the intensification of global competition in 6G technology. The alliance aims to promote the deep integration of artificial intelligence and wireless access networks, which will greatly enhance the intelligence level of 6G networks and provide users with more personalized and efficient services. For Chinese companies, this means facing greater pressure in terms of technology research and market layout. However, it also provides Chinese companies with an opportunity to align with international advanced levels through technological innovation and international cooperation, thereby enhancing their core competitiveness. In the face of possible technological blockade and monopolization, Chinese companies need to adjust their strategies to ensure their competitiveness in the global communication industry. Firstly, increasing investment in research and development, and strengthening independent innovation capabilities are fundamental ways for Chinese companies to respond to external challenges. At the same time, by establishing an open innovation system and attracting outstanding talents from home and abroad, technological progress and industrial upgrading can be accelerated. Secondly, actively seeking international cooperation can effectively avoid the risks of relying on a single market by participating in the formulation of global standards and establishing cooperative relationships with companies from other countries and regions in balancing the relationship between independent innovation and international cooperation. Chinese companies need to demonstrate an open and inclusive attitude while safeguarding their interests. By sharing research and development achievements and participating in international project cooperation, Chinese companies can not only complement each other technologically but also build a good business reputation globally. In addition, Chinese companies should actively participate in the formulation of international rules to create a favorable external environment for their development. In the future, the development of 6G technology will be a diversified and globalized process. Chinese companies should see the enormous opportunities contained in the challenges. Through continuous technological innovation and strategic adjustments, Chinese companies are expected to achieve leapfrog development.
in the 6G era and make significant contributions to the development of the global communication industry. That's all for today's video. Stay tuned for the next exciting content. Goodbye. Goodbye.